Yeah, it's not as easy as uh, quick, people quick, think, because like you say, they do tend there. to follow you around a little right, bit and spot where you're putting it. <laughs> You've got to kind of scatter it quicker than they can find it. <laughs> and then that's going to keep these guys nice and busy this afternoon, digging around and hunting that nice food. <laughs> Yeah, you can just tip any crumbs uh, out, that are left out on the floor, they'll still go and eat those. So you can see how they're having a little hunt round now, a little sniff in all the places you've just hidden the food, seeing if they can find it. So that's probably going to keep these guys busy for a little bit now. job with that food as well. Usually with kids you get one extreme to the other. You either get the kid who just tips it all out oh, on the floor yeah, straight away yeah. or you get the kid who has to put each one, one in individual <laughs> So it's either over in 30 seconds or over in about half an hour depending, <laughs> on, uh, <laughs> depending on which you get. But you did fantastic. You did a nice job of wandering around and finding a nice place for everything. So very well done there. So do you have any more questions about this guys before we make our escape? Do they change colour? So they don't really change colour as such, but what they will do, um, they go through a molt, uh, like a lot of animals do, so 